And we are underway in Sunday afternoon footy. Big kickoff from Burton, plenty of hang time. And a safety first approach from Talatau Amon. That's a great start for the Dogs. Short side from Reynolds. Little kick from Waddell. Dream start for the Dogs. Brilliant from the back rower to chase his own kick and score. Great execution. Dogs on the board first. Well, Tyra Sloan looked at him and thought, he's not going to kick, and then realised the ball was past him. And Corey Waddell was absolutely past Sloan before he realised that he'd actually kicked the ball. He's not going to kick. Why would he kick? And I Junior trying to keep it alive. Risky play. Lomax pounces. Foot race. I'm not sure they're going to catch him. He is rounded up, in fact. And what a pass. To Fine. Burns is labouring. Braden Burns in trouble. Holding him up, but Fine gets there. Please, back to the defence. That's careless. Yeah, low percentage play. And Lomax was off for the prize. Couldn't quite get there. Gave the ball to Matt Fine, and he did a, a tremendous job to get this ball down. I thought he was going to be held up there at one stage by Braden Burns, who, who did a great job himself to get underneath the football. But Matt Fine, he gets the ball down. Now, here is the 40-20 attempt out of tummy half from Embi. Didn't quite get the angle right. Took a Dragons bounce, and now it's a chance. Tied it up by Burns. Touchline an issue here, and they drag him over. It's Carl Oluwapu, welcome to first grade. 18 years of age, and straight into the action here, potentially. Avarillo puts the head down. He's got speed on the outside with the stutter move. Right through Sloan. Jake Avarillo is having a breakout season. What a great try. Well, we were wondering what the first moment of Carlo Luapu's career was going to be. He didn't think it was going to be a 100-metre sprint, the try celebration. That's a moment. The dogs go coast to coast. Injured and Hunt off the back of it for DeBellin. Now the Dragons are rolling. An offload there and a try was brewing. Still a quick play of the ball for Hunt. Almost away. Keeps it alive. Try time for Couchman. Just goes scooming out of dummy half. I thought he was going to score under the post. Ogenborg just caught him by the jersey. And on the Azuzu Emirax replay. Burton talking himself through this one. From 25 out, he puts the Bulldogs back in front. Forced the kick from inside their half. Casey given the run around. Look out. Bounces back into the end goal. Perham steps around a couple. Opens up for Hayes Perham. Where's the support? A little late in looming for him. Now headed for the touchline. Keeps it alive for Harrison Edwards. He was in a handy spot, wasn't he, just on? How would the coaches be up there? <laughs> it's great to watch. They're in the front row as he's just run on. Oh, Burns on the outside for Avarillo. Clean pair of heels. Little will have to give up the race. It's Sloan only. Avarillo, what a mover this guy is. He motors away for a ripper of a try. Left to right pass to get Avarillo on the one outside. One-on-one, Speedy. One-on-one, Zach Lomax has got the ball. W Waddell's not happy about it. He's going to give away a penalty the way this is going, and that's what Grant Atkins award. Ten in the bin. Hunt subtly for a moment. Outside, enough room for Fiene. And they do score against 12. Less than a minute after Waddell goes to the bin. We've got to keep the ball moving, the Dragons. It is the two-point field goal and not that's enough on it. The Bulldogs have come to the gong. And they're taking the two points home. The winning streak for the Dragons in Wollongong ends. What a win for the Bulldogs and Cameron Serraldo. 18 points to 16.